Hello? How are you doing, my friend? I'm fine. So you are a Muslim? What does that mean? Alhamdulillah, Rabbil Alameen. Who said to you that Alhamdulillah mean? Praise be to Allah. No. Do you speak Arabic? Do you speak Arabic? Alhamd means thanks to, not praise. No, it's not the same. No, it's not the same. No. Anyway, so you are calling me to say what? I will give you ten. Uh, I will give you ten, twenty hours, but there is no need for a minute. You can speak. It's open. The mic is open. Well, the question is: Is Andrew Tate is copying your prophet to work as a pimp? Okay. So, is if there is any evidence in the Quran that he can work as a pimp? Oh, all right, no problem. Do you, do you have your Quran with you? All right, okay. Open your Quran and go with me to this verse. And tell me what translation you are reading so I can put it in the screen for you. Chapter 24, verse number 33. 33, yeah. All right. Uh-huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. All right. All right. Allah is ever forgiving. Most merciful. What do you What do you understand about this verse? Well, you tell me. Sorry, uh, guy, no, tell me. Uh, uh, you sorry, guys. You're, the, his voice was uh, you not tell, coming. You, you tell me first, please. Okay. It tell says. It says, "For is not your girls into prostitution if they desire chastity." Correct. No, it doesn't say that. It says that. Read it. it um. Do not. <laughs> Those who hang on, who cannot those who cannot find the means to marry. Continue. Yeah, if any slaves you own want to make a contract to free themselves, write it for them. If you know good, if you know of good in them, and give them some of the wealth Allah has given you. Do not force your slave girls to prostitute themselves if they desire to be virtuous women. So you see, do not force. Yeah, do not force if they desire, if they desire. So if they agree to be prostitute, yeah. it's fine, yeah. correct? That's not true. That's it, not true. It says do not force them. No, it says there's a condition. Don't, don't stop there. Don't don't stop, don't stop there. Don't stop there. It says force them do not have, if they but, desire. If do not your, your force, slave girls. Yes, if to if if they desire to be thank you. Virgin. So do you, so do you see the word if? If they desire just a chase, so if they don't want to do the business, don't force them. And not only that, and if you force them, Allah is all merciful. No, that's not true. That, that it's in the front of you. Mean... It's in the front of you. If they desire, okay. Do you... Okay. It okay. Says here. Okay. You said. Hang on a minute. You can we time each other, please? Because I want to respect. My the friend, there's all. no time. You, you are talking. I'm not stopping you. Go ahead. Can I, speak, can I speak then, please? You are speaking. Who's holding you? Okay. Don't interrupt me, please, because that's what you do. <laughs> well, you can interrupt that's me too. You can interrupt me. No problem. Don't cry. That's what I'm saying. Let's do the time because people want to watch and listen. There's Christians. Exactly. Who are yeah. But, but, and we're having a conversation in the same time. We are two people. They have microphone open, so you cannot cry. Go ahead. It says, if they desire chaste. And we can open the interpretation for it. It's not up to you. We have Muslim scholars explaining those verses. There's no way it says you can force them. In fact, forcing a woman 
to be like a prostitute is wrong. It, it's haram in Islam. There's no okay. adversity. Where, where, what is and the punishment for forcing a woman to be a prostitute in Islam? G give me, give me the answer. Well, first of all, it's it's not even halal to force a woman. So, my friend, so, my friend, don't waste my time. It says there. It's not, it says there, if you force so, them, listen, listen, yeah. it says, if you force them, is Allah is all merciful. In Islam, if you if you do something wrong, there's a penalty for it. It says, the one who do this, beat them. The one who do that, cut their hand. The one who do this, stone them. Here you see, if they choose to be chased, and if you force them, Allah is all merciful, which may not a big deal. <laughs> well, you do know that, uh, prostitution in, in Islam is haram. It's not. That's it a lie. Here, that's a lie. That's a lie. That's that is. A, prove it. Prove yeah. it. Go ahead. Prove it. Can you give me? Well, it says here, don't force them, which means no, don't no, make no, them no. Right. You see, it says don't force them if they choose to be chased, which means if they agree, there's a condition. If they agree, it is halal. If you force them. Still, it's fine because there's no penalty. Allah is all merciful. Wait a minute. Are you aware that um, the slaves can actually go and do their own stuff as well, like despite being slaves and that? My friend, so, my friend, hey. don't, 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 don't drink seven up and jump seven st uh, steps. I'm asking you, does it say there, don't force their slaves? He's not talking about the slaves doing it. He's talking about you as a Muslim, owning women. You kidnap them from their houses and now you are forcing them to don't do force. business. Don't force. That's what it says. Don't force. What do you understand no, in that? It says okay. don't force them if they choose chaste, which means if they agree. What what a pimp he do usually, like Andrew Tate, what he do? He bring those girls and he tell them, I will make you rich, open your camera and be a hooker. This is what your Quran is saying. If they agree, it's fine. And if you force them, it's fine too. Allah is all merciful. <laughs> Honestly, man, Christian Prince, you just twist things about man about the Quran. It's in the front of you, and we can open no. the interpretation. Okay, where's your interpretation of it? Because okay. there's no way in Islam okay. that says this. What you choose? What about you choose for me the interpretation you want, and I will put it in the screen. Okay, what I'm saying is, yeah, you're not allowed to force my a friend, woman my friend, my friend. Why you are saying to me? Why you are saying to me? Where's your interpretation? But you don't want to show me the interpretation. What about we? Me and you, we show the yeah. interpretation, and everybody will see. Okay, you you interpret for me then. Go on. I just did. I'm asking you what interpretation but you like me to show you. But the Quran clearly stated, do not force them. No, the Quran says, if they choose, and if you do force them, it is still okay. Allah is merciful. <laughs> Those who cannot find the means to marry should be what marriage? This is not a marriage. Marriage. I mean, you're, you're, you know, and actually, the word marriage does not exist. It says nikah, nikah, which means to f, to f, not to marry. This is a false translation. Nikah han. <laughs> you see, this is your problem, Christian Prince. This uh -huh. is your problem. You're uh -huh. going wrong. This, yeah. is, this is stupid. A stupid guy who keep. Uh, 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 yeah, hold on, hold on, hold on. There's a there's yeah. an idiot. He keep texting me. He keep calling. He knew that we are talking and he keep calling. Let me block him. This guy is an idiot. Just give me a second, please. Fine. Okay. All right. I mean, some people, they have they have mental issue and they know we are talking and they are calling nonstop so they can bother our conversation. Well, look, all right, Prince, yeah. so my friend, my friend, listen, 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 listen. When you want to yeah. prove something, when you prove something, I'm using your yeah. book. I'm not bringing my own. Correct? Mm -hmm. Okay. So. I am not making things. I showed you the reference and the word is so clear. And you Muslim, you claim that Allah, he made the Quran so clear, correct? Isn't yeah. the Quran says, tafsira, which means we made it so clear? Yes, yes. All right. So now, how come you don't see it clear? It says, if they choose to be chased, for uh -huh. them not. So what is the condition? You know, you know what? There's a verse in the Quran where it says, if we don't know, ask. Okay. Ask, ask who? Uh, the, ask who? Knows. And the one that knows is the Rasul sallallahu no, alaihi wasallam. No, 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 no. You, the and Quran the, says no. The Quran says ask the Christians. Mate, when he says when he says ask the Christians, yeah, it's referring to the Arab pagans who didn't know. No, no. Yes. Here we go. Let me show you the Quran, my friend. You do not know what you do not know what you believe in. Okay, let me show you the Quran. Let me show you the Quran. You so we don't want to make speeches, you know. 
It says, on, yes. uh, actually, can we do it? Hold on, hold please. on, one by one, hold on, okay. Hmm? Can we do a timing, please? Go on, <laughs> stop, stop crying. We can talk in the same time, you know, and there, nobody okay, is stopping on. you from talking. So, what the timing for? So, here, chapter 10, verse number 94 says, If you have a doubt about what we reveal to you, Muhammad, go and ask the Christians and the Jews. Chapter again, 10, verse number 94. So, what you are saying absolutely is false. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, wait. Mm. Just wait one second, please. Let me switch to English. <clears throat> okay, because the Prophet uh -huh. um, at the time, uh -huh. at the time, yeah, he was it was quite new. Okay? Oh, he's a new in the business. No, no, wait, hang on, hang on. Uh -huh. can, I, can I finish? Can I pl please don't interrupt me? That's not okay, fair. Okay, is okay, it? okay, okay. Not fair. Uh -huh. Okay, because like because he was new. In, New in what? Um, revelations, receiving things about these things, yeah. Uh -huh, okay. When Allah, when Allah says to him that, yeah, hmm. for him, so that he can know, yeah, these, these things are actually in these things, but it doesn't mean that to go and confirm. Can it. you read the verse for me? Can you read the verse for me so I can understand how you get it this way? It said, if you're in doubt okay. about what we have, hmm. what we have sent to you, right. then ask those who were reciting the okay. book before you. Which means asking the people who are sat like the Jews and that kind of people. It's, okay. it's normally the Jews because did, the Christians were there. Did you, did you just say to me, if you are in doubt? Look, the prophet... Look, no, the prophet did, you, did you just say, did, my friend, did, did you just say the word, if you are in doubt? Is that correct? You say that or I'm hearing it says, something when wrong? When it's in doubt, it's not actually talking about not actually believing. It's about actually to go and actually see these things. Say, oh, to, yeah, to, to, exactly. what? to what? To what? To what? To what? To the what? I don't. What? Look, look. Do you really believe like the the, the Torah and the Injilia? Yeah, you don't share topic. Yeah? Don't share topic. Is that, he is no, in no, doubt. He's, he's in doubt in what? He's he's a, the same. He's in. He's in doubt. Finish. No, he's in doubt. In, your prophet is in doubt in what? Let me finish, please. Let me finish, please. Yeah, uh -huh. it's fair. Mm -hmm. it, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now the Quran is here to confirm the Torah and the Injil. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Now. Not every single story in in the Torah is correct because if you look at the stories, yeah, in the Quran, it um and the Torah, the same stories but are different. One, I will give you an example, yeah, Aaron, in the Bible, yeah, hmm. when Moses went down to the went up to the mountain to speak to Allah, yeah, mm -hmm. when he left Aaron to be in charge, it uh -huh. says in there, hmm. Arun, alayhi salam, he created an idol for the. Um, the Jews to worship it. The mm. Quran, he says, it's not him. He was threatened mm. and um, he was overpowered. Okay. There's a man there let us, called let us finish. Let us, let, let us finish this one, and we will go to the story of Arun, and everybody will laugh, my friend, because what you are saying is really is 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 a is a, is a, is a silly thing. But listen, let listen. Let me finish. No, 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 no. Hold on, hold on, hold on. First of all, the Quran never say the Quran never say the Quran confirms some of the Bible. The Quran confirm. No. The Quran, we will go after we finish this one. I promise you, let's go, go there. On. Okay, so now let us finish this one. So, you said that your prophet he was in doubt because he was in you. Did you say that, or I'm, I'm making things up? No, 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 it's it's Allah that's actually telling him, Look, basically, these things they are also in the other scriptures, but it doesn't mean like he's in doubt. Like, he, no, 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 he you said, I ask, I'm asking you, let me repeat, let me repeat. Let me, you are not listening, you are not listening. You are not listening, okay. my friend. You he said you said he is in doubt. He, Allah he told him to go and ask the Christian and the Jews because he was new in the revelation, correct? Yes, he was new then okay. and because but this is a chapter number fifty one, my friend. This is a chapter fifty one in the Quran. Chapter fifty one. Okay. Look, he, he didn't even let me finish. That's not fair. So how you know? he is in you in the business of a prophethood. And this is in chapter 51, according to the book of Revelation, uh, according to, uh, to Revelation, which means now in the Quran, you have it number 10. But in fact, in the real Quran, in the Quran, which is not corrupted yet, it is 51. You can open any Islamic website. It says that chapter of Yunus is a chapter number 51. It's not 10. 
So when you say to me, because he's in you, this is laughable. Now Muhammad is 50% he received the Quran. And now you are saying to me, he is in you? No, listen, listen. When I say new, I'm not talking about he's new, new, like from the beginning. Because he's somebody, basically, yeah? If you look at the whole Arabian Peninsula, yeah? Uh -huh. Yeah? Uh -huh. Most of them, most of them, yeah, except Medina, Medina area. Uh -huh. Most of them don't even believe in the God of Abraham. Oh. So throughout these things, yeah, when mm. I say new, it's because he's new in this kind of religion since the age of 40. Not like from day one. I'm not talking about from day one. I'm talking about throughout his whole career as a prophet, yeah? So he's a new so, win. What what in you mean? How many years to, to be new? Consider still no, new. I'm not using the, the, the years. I'm talking about throughout, throughout his, whole, his whole career as a prophet, yeah? Okay, so when, you are saying to me, that Muhammad now he received, he received 50, 51 chapter of the Quran. Still, he have a doubt about what he is receiving. When when Allah says that, yeah, Allah just wants to reinforce, reinforce him, yeah, with that kind of stuff. That's fine. In um in the old days of the prophets, Allah re reinforces them. You know what I mean? Hmm. But Allah, okay, Allah but you said to me, but you said to me that our yeah. book is not perfectly preserved. And now your God is asking Muhammad to go and yeah. ask those who corrupted their book to confirm to him that he is a prophet. Don't you think this is a really stupid? How they are corrupting, how they are corrupting, how they are bad, how they are hypocrite, how they are kuffar. Isn't the Quran called the Christians kuffar? Isn't the Quran called the Jews kuffar? So how are you asking the kuffar? Go, Muhammad, to the kuffar and ask them to confirm to you that you are a prophet. Go ahead. <laughs> Can I talk? Okay. Mm. Now, when Allah is talking about, yeah, to, to go to the people of the book, yeah, to check their stories, uh -huh. it's not actually saying every single thing there is correct. Where do you get um, this from? Where do you get this from? How do I get it? Because the Quran contradicts, yeah, the, uh -huh. the Bible, like Aaron, the story of okay, Aaron. Okay, but Aaron hold on. But, but, the, the, but, the Quran, but the Quran it's never it's have a story of Aaron. Where is the story of Aaron in the Quran? It's, um... Uh, I think Surah Utaha, something like that. Let there is no story of Aaron. What Aaron? What Aaron did in the Quran? Go, let us laugh. Uh, okay, this is the problem. Let me finish then. Let so you're making talking. things up. You're making things I, up. And if I ask you now, if I ask, listen, if I ask you where Aaron okay. was, who was Musa, you do not know. Who is Abraham, you do not know. Who is Israel, you do not know. Who is Jibreel, okay. you do not know. So don't don't mix things up. So let, let me ask you. You said, you said because the Quran, you said because the Quran contradict the Bible. But which one came first? The Bible. So, if the Quran contradicts, that means the Quran is invalid. And now, let me ask you: Does the Quran does the Quran contradict does the Quran contradict the Quran? Okay, can I talk now, please? Hmm, go please. Ahead. Yeah. Okay. Do you read? It says in the Bible, Aaron created an idol for the Jews to worship. Do you accept that? My friend, we will go to there. I'm asking you. I'm asking you. Please. Anything in the Bible. Anything the Bible say, give me the verse and we can confirm or we refuse. So I'm asking you, anything in the Bible I accept, you said it's contradict. You said that, correct? Yes, because okay. the Bible. So how you control. accept the man, how you accept the man who never but met Aaron, he never witnessed Aaron, he was not there to tell you about Aaron. God was there, God okay. witnessed him. The Quran says That's that Aaron is the brother. Okay, uh, uh, the Quran says that Aaron, Aaron is the brother of Mary. Well, that one, can I talk that one, please? Don't interrupt me. Can I talk that go one, ahead, please? Go ahead. Okay. When the Quran talks about, um, uh, it says, oh, sister of Arun to the mother of Jesus, yeah? Uh -huh. That's in reference that, That's in reference to so, yeah? That, that that family comes from the line of Aaron. False. Which is a fact. False, false. They are they are two different hold on they are two different tribes they are two, dif two different tribes secondly 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 hold on we are talking you know me and you it's okay it's a conversation because if i let you go you get away with something i cannot do that my friend hold on no if you are first of all i don't say the sister if you are if you are coming from the lee from the from the seed of somebody i don't say the sister i say the daughter i say the daughter okay. Not no, the sister. sister, not the sister, because if she is just in, in the time of, of uh, her time she is born, then the guy who was talking about him, if he is exist hundreds and maybe a thousand years before, then we don't call her the sister of this guy. First, he is higher than her. He's a prophet. Secondly, if he, she is from yes. his seed, as you claim, 
then we should say it, the daughter of Aaron, not the sister of Aaron. So how they become sister and brother? And now, and now if we go in the Quran, listen, who is the father of the father of, mm -hmm. of, uh, of, yeah. uh, of Aaron? Who is the father of Aaron? Okay, can I can I answer please without interrupting me? Go ahead. Who is the right. father of Aaron? You agree? At least, at least give me two minutes, please. My please. friend, we can talk in the yeah. same time. It's okay. I mean, I'm, I'm, I, I'm, I am muting you. No, you can talk. Okay. No problem. At, at least let me finish then, please. Yeah. Okay. It's who, fair, is the, who is the father of Aaron? Okay, Aaron, the mm. old Aaron in the Bible, yeah, uh -huh. with uh -huh. the brother of Moses. His father's name is Imran. Yeah. Thank you very much. Who is the father of Mary in the Quran? <laughs> Let me finish then, please. Yeah. Uh -huh. Now, um, Mariam, the the mother of Jesus. Yeah. Uh -huh. Yeah. His father, his name is either Imran or metaphorically. Ah, metaphorically. Metaphorically. Wait, metaphorically. Okay, wait, hold on. Listen, listen. Wait. Let me finish. Let me finish, please. Why you don't do this? It's not fair. No, no problem. Fair, no please. problem. Can you prove it to me that it's metaphorically? Yeah. Again, again, to show to you, yeah. That line, um, the family of um, uh, Mary, Mary's father, and that family, yeah, hmm. they come from direct descent of Imran and Arun, the brother, um, of Moses. Because if you look at it, the Messiah and um, the, the the people that will control the temple, mm -hmm. yeah, they are descendants of Harun alayhi salam. That is why Isa alayhi salam, okay, Jesus come from that family. All right, all right. So, all right. Okay, sure, but can you sure show me now? Can you show me where how you get the conclusion from the Quran? You are a Muslim. You are a Muslim. I, I how you can okay? So how you get the conclusion that when the Quran says that Mary she is the daughter of Amran, this is not the real name. It was a metaphorical. Where do you get this from? Because if you look at it, yeah, Imran, yeah, uh -huh. yeah. Mm -hmm. No, I said it's either his proper name or metaphorically. That's why I said. No, don't I tell me either. Give me an answer. Right? This is not the potato right. tomato. Oh, no, no, video, you okay? it, you, no, you say it. No, you say it. You say it. It is a metaphorical name. Now you are hey, you, you are biting your tongue. Metaphoric. That's what I said. Okay. Don't change. Don't change okay. what I said. So please, it is right? not a real name of the father of Mary. You agree? It could be. Eh? Or, or it could not be. That's what I said. What do you mean could be, could not be? What is what kind of answer this answer? So look, look so look now what we have. We confirm, I'm, I'm, we confirm I'm, I'm, that I'm, the I'm, father I'm, of Aaron, the father of Aaron is Amran, as you said. And now yeah. Aaron, he have a sister, her name is Maryam. Do we agree? Okay, can I explain that one as well? So listen, I won't, give me a chance. if you go explain if that. you go to the, to the book of Exodus, chapter four, chapter two, you will see that Mary uh, 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 the daughter of Amram, Amram, your prophet do not even know how to quote the name. And Aaron yep. and, and, and his sister, sister Miriam. So Miriam is the sister of Aaron. Okay, this is true. Can I explain that, so please, Muhammad, he thought, I... and then there's a Jewish rabbi, he came and he told what him, he told him. Aisha, this so, is wrong. There's hundreds of years between them. So Aisha, she told Muhammad, and now Muhammad tried to fix it, but it's too late because already he spoke about Imran, that he is the father of Mary. And when I ask you about Mary, being the daughter of Imran, what you said, it's metaphorical. And then a two minutes oh, after, you. You did bite your tongue and you say, ah, maybe, maybe it's true name. No, listen, listen. No, no, listen. I want you to tell me. I want you to tell me. I want you to tell me. I want you to confirm. Is it a metaphorical name? Is it a metaphorical name? Or it is? No. I said to you, it's either metaphorical or either his proper name. Due to due to the link of family from Aaron and Imran. So he is not, so the, so the real father of Mary is not Amran. Do we agree? The real, the no. The real father of Mary, the mother of Jesus, yeah, yeah, his name is either Imran or metaphorically. This Ooh, is what I'm saying. Okay, I'm asking you, give me an answer. Is it possible that this is his real name or not? It's possible, it's his real name, or it's just in a metaphorical way to show okay. how in the world Mary name became the father, her name became Amran. And that why why the chapter is called chapter of Al Amran? And you said to me metaphorical. Tell me what metaphorical for? Do you know what even Amran mean? Do you know what Amran mean? I don't know the meaning of Imran. So no, how that know. can be metaphorical? Is it no, the Quran, I, my friend, no, my friend? I, Muslims always they lie. Muslims well, are always they lie, and we get them busted. Look what the Quran says. The Quran no, I, says that Amran, Amran, he said to his wife. So when you say to me that this is possible to be metaphorical, we are laughing, you know, for what you said. Let me talk. Please. Because Let because talk, the, because the verse says it clearly, you know, and you are making things up. Amran he said to his wife, and the wife of Amran she said to her husband, 
And now you are saying to me, it's a metaphorical name. How in the world you say such a thing? No, when I say metaphorical, what I meant is that, yeah, because sometimes, yeah, they um, they may call you, yeah, in the name of your ancestor no. as, a, as a way of showing respect. The, the Quran, like, no, the saying, Quran, the Quran the says the wife of Amran, the wife of Amran, the wife of Amran, she said, the wife of Amran, not the daughter, the sister, etc., and sister, no. We are talking about the family now. So the wife of Amran, she said, who said that? Open chapter three, verse number thirty-six. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The wife, the wife of Imran. Yeah. Yeah. So why you are saying to me still? Why why you Muslims you are lying and saying? Oh, I'm you know what? Uh, uh, you know, even you're not even letting me explain. You see, this is a problem. You no, no, you explained you... already. But this is not what it says. You, you... It says she okay. is the wife of Imran. Does it say metaphor? Does it say he is calling the ancestor? So now look what you do. When he say the sister of Aaron, you say metaphorical because she is from river, blah, blah, blah. Now we have the okay. wife of Amran. You say this is metaphorical because it's a blah, 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 blah. That is funny. And and Amran, he have nothing to do. Amran, the father of Aaron, have nothing to do with the father of Mary. Nothing. True. But... Can I can I talk one minute, please? Please don't please for one minute for the viewers. Okay, please. Go, go, go. Yeah. Uh -huh. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. Can we do timing, please? Don't worry about the timing. You are crying too much, okay. but you give me nothing. Okay, fine, fine. One minute. One minute. Yeah. Okay. So, um, Aaron, the brother of Moses. Yeah, he is the direct descendant of that family. Listen to me carefully. Who, 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 He's the who? Family. Even the Jews confirmed that the Messiah, hang on, the, the Jews confirmed the Messiah mm. is a direct descendant of Aaron. That's where people like, even um, the priesthood family comes from Aaron. Ah, That's true, isn't it? The, the, the Jews, they confirmed <laughs> that. Okay, can you give me the reference? Can you give me the reference? Can you give me the reference? My friend, my friend, my friend. No, no, I will not let you continue for 20 minutes saying nothing because I want reference. Can you give me the reference where the Jews confirm that Mary, she is descendant of Aaron? You see, you said, I said one minute, you're not even letting me talk. You said the Jews. Yes, 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 my friend, because I like, I don't let people keep, keep going forever saying nothing. I, I don't want to waste my time. You said the Jews, you said the Jews, the Jews, the Jews, the Jews, the Jews. Okay. Can you show me where the Jews they say that Mary she is descended from Aaron? Go and check it. You're gonna find I don't yeah. wanna check it. You check it. You are the scholar. Okay, I'm learning from you. And if you, Mary, you, my friend, if Ma let us say you, for the sake of you, argument, Mary she is descended from Santa Claus, not from Aaron. Huh? What does have to do with the name? It says the wife of Aaron. It says the, 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 the wife of, uh, of of Amran. Amran is the father of Moses. What this have to do with our topic? So you are trying to find a way to escape, and even your Islamic interpretation says that yes, this is the name of the father of Mary. So now we have the same name of the father. We have Maryam. She is the sister of Aaron, and we have the Quran confirm that. And and now listen, listen, listen. Just to make it simple, can you consider the Quran a book of history? It's, it's a book of from uh, from Allah Subhanahu wa Taala. I mean, can it's you not, can you take can you take history from the Quran? Yes, if if it's from Allah, yes. Okay, take it. as long you are expert with the uh, with with the uh, like you have some knowledge in the in the Jews. Uh, when we say the summary, the summary where they are exist. Well, a summary. Uh huh. Apparently, I mean, I've seen a little bit about them. They're about this. A form of uh, a type of Judaism and that. Ah. I don't know where. I don't know um, okay. where they are. Was a summary <laughs> exist in the time of Aaron? Remember, you are the one who mentioned that before. You said Aaron. Yes, the Quran okay. Yes, the so Quran who is yes. the one who mislead the Jews? Is it does it say the summary? Yes, it does say it. Yeah. Okay. The in, the, in the time of Aaron, in history, in the books of the Jews, the summary was there. Okay. At what? At what time? You tell me which time no, the same which which time already, which time already, my friend what time already, what time what time what time the Samarian they will exist in the look, in the time of Moses look, in the time of you, no you tell me you, you tell me you, are they exist in the time of Moses to worship do you believe Aaron created idol for the Jews to worship? Don't change the topic. You see, we will see if he no. did or not. We will see if this is true or not. Now listen, listen. 
you, the Quran says that the Samari came and he misled them, correct? That's right, yeah. Okay, but there was no Samari at that time exist. There was, because the Quran says it, there was. Ah, so because the Quran says, aha, yep. uh -huh. but no, we have books, we have books of history proving, have nothing to do with Judaism or Christianity, saying that right. this is absolutely cannot be true. Even those books what written by by what? scholar of, of geography, biography, and they say this is absolutely false. I will make it simple for everybody. So now we ask you about the pimp. The Quran says, force them not if they choose a chastity. You fail to give me any proof that it's forbidden in the Quran because it says it clearly, you can be a pimp. We have tons of, uh, if we, book, if we open the book, if we open the book of Muwatta Malik, it even tell you how you can examine a woman. And if you touch her private part in the market, you have to take her. So don't tell me this is Islam, my friend. Omar al Khattab, Omar, Omar, Omar ibn al Khattab, Omar ibn Khattab, he did beat a woman because she covered herself and he said to her, Do you want to act like a free woman? And he did beat her and they used to serve food and their breast is bouncing. I can show you the reference. But now let us go to the Quran, which one you are saying that you believe in it. You said that 100%. You, said, you, said, the, you said something very important the Quran on. contradict the Bible. Correct? Well, yeah, because the Bible has got things wrong, so it's, it's there to correct okay. them. Well, until now, I showed you many things. It is the new Quran wrong. Quran but I want to ask you. I want to ask you a very simple thing in the front of everybody. Sorry. Okay, which one Allah created first, the mountains or the stars? Do you know what? I don't. I don't remember in the back of my head for that one. But it's it. it these creations are in the Quran. No, but I don't no, know. no, 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 no. You can take your, time, take your time. 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 Here we go. I will sit and quiet. You guys. What does it matter though? Mountains. It matter. Created. It matter for me. You will see why. Why? You will see. Isn't why? this? Isn't this is the book correct? The Bible. Can you tell me why? Are you scared to tell me the answer? Why that Are you scared to why? tell me the answer? Are you scared no, to tell you me the tell answer? No, tell me why. Okay, okay, I'm scared. Yeah, I'm scared. Go on, tell okay, me why. Okay, I will not tell you until you give me the answer. I'm not going to give you the answer because why? it's not necessary. What's no, the do point you know why? Because if you give me the answer, everybody, if you give me the answer, my friend, then everybody will know that your God is a potato God. He cannot be God. Okay, have you ever heard? Have you ever that? heard of someone do not remember which one he created first? Look, it, that doesn't matter to us as long as it's in the Quran. Ah, believe me, that's so you are the one said that uh, the Quran contradict the, the Bible, and now we are showing you that the Quran contradict the Quran. Isn't it the Quran says if this is a book made by other than Allah, you will find in it a lot of contradiction? Right, yeah, and there's none, there's no contradictions there. So then, then tell me, here we go. This is the challenge. Then tell me, then tell me, then tell me which one Allah created first, the mountains or the stars. Okay, can you show me the reference there then, please? Where it says that. Why you didn't tell me? me? I did not say any, I did not say anything yet. I'm asking you which one created first. Look, 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 look the Quran is a big book here. Yeah? It's, it's a, a big, big book. book. Uh, My friend, all your Quran, all your Quran, all your Quran is not even in the size of the index of my book. So don't tell me it's a big book. This is why you can memorize it. It's an index. Yeah. How many pages? You can. I saw a guy. He wrote the Quran in a matchbox. Matchbox size. So it is so okay. tiny, so small. So I'm asking you now. Why you it is. Okay. Okay. Listen, 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 listen. I'm going to give you a verse. I'm going to give you a verse in the Quran. And you tell me. You tell me, based on this verse, what you think. Go on. All right. Are you going back to your internet to find out? Stop. Chapter 2, verse number 29. Oh, chapter, two, chapter 2, verse number 29. Read it for us, please. Okay. 229. Hmm. How come we don't face people to debate people face to face? I am facing people. I'm, I'm speaking to your no, ass no, now. No, 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 no. Am I speaking like, to your ass? No, I mean like people like Sam Shamoon will face people. people I, you like know, for me, for me, I'm not handsome, my friend, like you. You like to be in camera. <laughs> I'm not a camera guy. Yeah. <laughs> Come on, man. Come yeah, on, you can yeah, face. Yeah. Not a problem. Yeah. You can wear, you can wear niqab, you know, and no, you, face. No, your God, him. Allah, he wear niqab, my friend. Don't you know no, Allah, he wear hijab? No, no, no. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. You are trying to insult me. Isn't it true that your Allah, he wear hijab? No, a lot of you wear hijab. Okay, let's go to the Quran. Here we go. Let's have a look. Okay, hold on. He... No, no, no. Hold on, hold on. Don't, don't, don't change. We will go. We will go there. Hold on. Here we go. 
This is your God, Allah. He will not speak to anyone except from behind the hijab. Why you are lying saying Allah don't wear hijab? You try to insult yeah, me. Says, chapter says, 42, chapter, me, chapter chapter 42, verse number 51, it says, where, where, Allah where? will not speak you, to anyone except from behind a veil. Okay, can I talk now, please? So your God Allah is a female and he talk, wear hijab. Yeah. This is your problem. You keep interrupting people. You don't let people because speak. Because you try to insult me and you think you can get away with it. You cannot. You are talking to Christian Prince, my friend. I smash your God like a potato. Okay, so we, we just please. found, you said to me, you can work a hijab. You can wear a hijab. When your Muslim, his name is Mimi Hijab, Muhammad Hijab. And your God, you, Allah, he don't speak except from behind the hijab. Can you explain to us I what hijab please. of Allah? Can I talk, please? Go ahead. <laughs> okay, you didn't even you didn't even let me go to that chapter. We will two. go back. We will go back. Don't worry. We did not skip it. You keep, you keep skipping things. Just no, you are the one. You are the one who okay, mentioned the hijab. If you behave up. yourself, if you behave yourself, we will not be now getting your god busted. He wear a hijab. He's a female. Go ahead. Where do you want to go now? Okay, tell me where. Which chapter? Go to the Quran, chapter 20, uh, 42, verse number fifty-one. The hijab of Allah. Okay, go ahead. Okay. okay. Mm. Chapter what? Sorry, can you repeat, please? Chapter forty-two. Chapter forty-two. What chapter is verse it again? Sorry. Number, ver, verse number fifty. Yeah. Fifty. Uh, sorry, uh, yeah. Uh, chapter fifty-one. Uh, forty-two. Verse number fifty-one. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Let me read it out, please. Don't interrupt. Yeah. Please. Yeah. All right. Go ahead. It says it does not befit Allah to address any human being except by inspiration or from behind a veil. Or he sends a messenger who then reveals by his permission whatever he wills. He is indeed most high, all wise. Uh, he is indeed most high, most uh, all wise. Okay. Mm. Can I respond, please, to this? Okay, go ahead. Thank you. When Allah says the veil here, it's not actually talking about the physical veil like women wearing veil. Uh, this is to show the people. Hang on. Let me, let me, just, let me finish. Please. I did not say anything. Continue. <laughs> go ahead. Please, let me finish. I just yeah? said, ah, that's all. I didn't say anything. Go ahead. Okay, okay, yeah. <laughs> okay, well, this verse is actually talking about metaphorical veil, which means Allah doesn't actually allow oh, people to Oh, it's a metaphorical veil. You see, anything yeah, I show you, anything I show you, it's a metaphorical. The name of, you know, of Mary, Father, it's a metaphorical. The okay. Mary, she is the sister of Aaron, it's a metaphorical. Allah is wearing a veil like a girl. It's a metaphorical. No, listen, 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 listen. Can you give me any proof or reference say this is metaphorical? Because hmm. when it says here, from behind a veil, yeah, uh -huh. yeah, uh -huh. Allah doesn't need to wear a veil How for you know? people. How you know? How you know? How you know? How you know? This is your problem. You keep, this is what you do to Muslims. You see, you, I'm just you, talking to you. I did not mute you, my friend. We are having a conversation. You know, we are drinking okay. tea together. How you know? How you know? Can I talk now? How you know? Okay. How do I know? Because yeah. I know that, yeah, uh -huh. me and you and every human being in history has never seen God. Okay? Even mm. even angels don't see God. Why? Mm. Because Allah has put a veil there, mm. not like women's wearing a veil, mm. to, to put something there where... There's not even a barrier between us, but you can't see you can't see Allah. Oh. It's like the jinns. But hang on, it's like the jinns. Some jinn, some jinns, yeah, you can't see them unless they want to reveal themselves to you. Hmm. But there's no veil there, like ladies wearing a veil. There's so, nothing there. But you said he put something between you and him, so you don't see him. You just said that. You said something. No, when I say, yeah, hmm. that something is, yeah, Allah basically uses his power, yeah. To mm -hmm. put a block without putting actually sorry without putting something there it, it's a power that basically stop us from seeing allah but it's not a veil like ladies oh. this is what i'm telling you okay so, so are allah, you saying to me allah he used the word hijab and he was mistaken yeah. he should use the word power there's a veil here veil veil veil, veil can mean also metaphorically it doesn't mean physically okay you know that okay power. hold on you hold know? on hold on you see anything we say we say it's possible it's possible so the quran is a book of possibility correct no, no. You know, even the Bible has got metaphorical things. You know that yourself. I'm asking so you. You see, point, you, 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 are keep, you keep, you keep uh, running, running away from the answer. I'm saying, when you say it's possible, it is metaphorical, possible to be metaphorical. Is it, is it possible to be true? 
Is it possible to be true hijab? Is it true? Is it possible to be true hijab? When it says veil, when it says veil, it's actually showing, yeah? Yet we can't see Allah. That's what it means by a veil. No, it says from behind a veil. Behind. So he is behind that thing. No, it's not. It says that. Read it. Not a physical veil. Not how do you know it's not a, how you know it's not a physical? How do you know it's not a physical? Didn't need a physical okay. veil. For is Allah is Allah is a physical person? Well, like a human being. I'm asking you a question. Don't play. Answer, don't play a rubber. Don't don't play a rubber. He bounce in the floor. Is he a physical being? Like a human being or just a? Did being? I say to you like a human being or a cat? I said, is yes, he yes, a physical Allah being? A physical being. Yes, Allah is a physical being. Okay, yeah. that means he have a physical veil. For a physical being, he no, can it listen. Listen. He, listen. He is a physical being, which means he can be seen. Correct. Um, a lot does it need, like me and you, like if I see you and mm. I want to hide from you to put a veil, mm. a lot does it need that. So what he need? So what he need? A lot can just do it like that, or we can't see him, just like but that. But he said a veil. He said the word veil, not me. That veil is metaphorically. Okay. I've just but he you. said from behind the veil, and now you are making it metaphorically, when there is no proof of the metaphorical of it, he said the veil, and the word in Arabic is so clear, and he said the word behind. He didn't say he put between you like uh, something uh, to, 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 to avoid you from seeing him. No, he said from behind the veil, which means he is in the behind, you are in the front. That's not true. Okay. Metaphorically, uh, I just told you the veil means metaphorically, mate. Okay. okay. Okay, hold on. Uh, uh, are you Muslim when you go to heaven you will see Allah? In heaven, yeah, it it says um Muslims who are righteous, like let's say the prophets of Allah, hmm. and every Friday they, they will. But this dunya what, what they what Allah. they will do every Friday? What they will do every Friday. Okay, can I respond please? Go ahead. Okay. In this in this dunya, no human being can see Allah, <laughs> even the prophets of Allah. Okay. No human being, because Musa alayhi salam in Surah Surah Al Taha or somewhere, one of the mm. chapters, yeah, mm. he requested to see Allah, and Allah said to him, "It's it's not possible to see me." That's why Musa alayhi salam fainted mm. when you know Allah tried to reveal Himself, Musa, just to show him, "You cannot see Allah." Okay. So in this dunya, hang on, wait, let me finish. In this dunya. Mm. There's no one can even angels can see the physical form of Allah. Okay. Are you is that is that clarified? I will I will okay, I will go with you. But you said to and me then, wait, you said to me wait, wait, Okay, hold on. Wait. You said to me, me every Friday, every Friday in heaven, yeah. Allah, you, will, you will see Allah, correct? Every yes, Friday you will see Allah. Huh? Yes. Uh, the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, I think in one of the um um, hadith it says the pious ones like the prophets of Allah every Juma, yeah, they will see Allah. Why? Because that's heaven, that's heaven, that's not the world here. Okay, that's what, a what will happen in, in what will happen every Friday? Can you if you can just let me a little bit information? But look, I don't know everything because what Allah revealed to us the proof to the Prophet, hmm. that's all I know is that every Friday, the ones who are pious, like prophets of Allah, every Friday they will see Allah. Okay, that's enough mm. for me to know that. Okay, I don't need to go and lie to you. I'll okay, you I will, uh, then I will give you the information. According to the uh, your prophet story, every Friday, yeah. every every yeah. Thursday, an angel will come yeah. to you and will give you a card to invite you to the party of Allah, and then mm. there is a chair for every Muslim. You sit in your mm -hmm. chair, and then there's a three singers will stand on the stage and they will sing, starting from David, then Muhammad, then Allah. Is that correct? Where is this? I mean, I don't have the hadith with me, but is this in the hadith? This is in the hadith, yes. And they will sing for you. And then Allah, each time one of them he sing, he asked you, they will sing, they will, uh, David will, sing, well, they will sing the psalm, and Muhammad will recite the chapter of Muhammad from the Quran, and Allah will recite uh, the chapter of Ar Rahman. And then each okay. time Allah, he asked you, have you ever heard something better than this? So now we have, and you are a person who is speaking about uh, logic and etc. We have a God, he making a, a party every Friday and the same three singers singing the same song for eternity. And he keep asking you the same question every Friday. Have you ever seen something better than this? And you say, no, we swear Allah, but you just saw this last week and the week before it and the week before it. 
have you ever heard of a god making American Idol program every Friday the same song the same singers and they are three winners only so my friend your religion is a silly stupid religion now let us go let us go to the verse hold on let us go to the verse which we skip you know you you say to me Allah veil is a is a is a metaphorical but you fail to prove it to me you fail miserably isn't it the Quran says that Allah was in the fire okay go on where okay. does it say that? So, I don't know why each time I say to you, you say to me where it says that. I thought you are the Muslim. I am, but look, when you say this here, like I just told you, the Quran is a massive book. Sometimes I need reference. Ah, massive in the size of index of my what phone book. Want, okay, want, chapter, can... chapter 27, <laughs> chapter 27, yeah. verse number 8. Who was in the fire and he was a blessed one? Hang on, hang on. 27. Verse number 8. Yeah, <clears throat> look, just just not me knowing it from my head. It doesn't mean I don't know the Quran. Come on, don't do that. No problem. I'm sure I'm sure you don't remember everything in the Quran, in the Bible in your head, mm, man. True, Come true. on. Yeah. Okay. Um. Which which verse? Chapter twenty seven, the chapter of ants. The Quran yeah, is like yeah, a book of Zoom. Verse. Yes. Which verse? Yeah. Verse number eight. Okay. Okay. Give Give me a second. Hmm. Okay, can I read it out for you? Go ahead. It says, but when he reached it, a voice called out to him, bless to him who is by the fire and all who are around it. Glory be to Allah, the Lord of the whole worlds. Who is Musa. in the fire? Hang on, wait. I, I need to read the whole thing for the context. Okay, when take Musa your time. I think it's a metaphorical too. Okay, hang on. When Musa said to his people, I can make out a fire, I'll bring you news from it, or at least a burning brand, so that hopefully you will be able to warm. This is Musa's family when he's, he was about to rece receive his first revelation. But when he reached it, a voice called out out of the fire, blessed be to him who is by the fire, and all who are around it, glory be to Allah, and the lords of the whole world. Now, Yes. Okay. Yes. Can, what's your What's your problem with this verse? Who Who is the one in the fire? Allah is not the fire. The fire is just. There I did not say. I did not say Allah is the fire. No. I said who is in the no. fire. No one. It's just the fire there, like that. Okay, guys. Did you be my witness? He said no one is in the fire. Did you just say that? Yes, I did say that. So your God Allah did lie because it says, "Bless the one is in the fire." Bless. The one is by the fire, not in it's the fire. It's in the fire. No, no. <laughs> by the it's fire. in the fire. And the one yeah. is around the fire. Okay, give me the translation you are reading. Okay. Can I read it again? It says... No, don't read it again. You did read it already. I want to show everybody that you are not telling the truth. Give me the translation you are reading. No, you're not telling the truth. It so says give me a translation. I will put it in the screen. Give me a translation. Who is the translator you are reading okay. from? Um... I'm not sure you know this person, you know. Oh, uh, so you take anyway. a Quran from Shish Kebab Hummus guy, you do not know who is translating, and you take it for granted, huh? <laughs> anyway, anyway. Um, no, 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 anyway, not this, anyway. This, this, no, 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 no. So now hey. a religious Muslim, he grab a book I, translated by hey. Mickey Mouse, translated um, by Mickey Mouse. He don't know even who is the translator. You are lying. The book is there. It says who's translator. You are afraid I that I will put it in the screen and then everybody will laugh at your lie. Okay, give me the translation, the translator name. Okay, so, so so now you're making a fool of yourself. I do know the translator's name. It's actually here. So why you don't tell me? I asked you. I said, I, know, I don't know who. I was about to tell you. I was about to tell you, Christian Prince. Okay, okay. Tell me, tell me, tell me. Okay, go ahead. Come on, man. Come on, you got to have patience, okay? Okay, tell me, go ahead. We've got to respect each other, man, no matter how much difference okay, we have. Okay, 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 man, okay. Okay, this one is Abdul Haq and Aisha Biwli. Abdul, Abdul Haq what? Abdul Haq Biwli and Aisha Biwli. What, uh, is that in English? Well, this man, I, I, I've actually met him personally. He's a convert, but he's changed his name to Abdul Haq. Ah, uh, he but changed his gender. Okay, so how a convert who do not know Arabic, he trans he translate the Quran. Change the name, not gender. Uh, okay, so he is a, a person who converted to Islam yesterday, and now he is explaining the Quran to you by his translation. 
Well, <coughs> I'm sure he um, got together with people who know Quran very well to help him. Can you because... call him? Can you call him to join us so we can laugh more? No, no, I mean... I okay, no well, here we go. This is, the, this is the Quran. You can open any Islamic website. It says in Arabic, Okay, what Burika, you say there, hold on. You see, just to show you that you are being a fool. I'm not insulting you. To to take a Quran from somebody is an idiot. Burika man fi nor wa man hawlaha. You can copy this sentence, post it in Google, and you will see. And not only that, you can go and see any translation, any translator, and you will see. It says, like an example, this is here. This is a translation in the Muslim website. Let us see who is the translator here. This is. Muhammad Hilali and Muhammad Khan together they have a translation it says but when he come to it he was called blessed is who is ever in the fire not in by the fire in the fire the, and the one the who is around the fire right look the fire by the way is not a lot it was there for the attention of don't Musa, change the topic the I'm not I'm not this is not my question I'm asking you does it say the one is in the fire? Um, no, it doesn't say that actually. So you are it taking a, you are taking a lie. So now we have a new Quran. There's a Quran made by Abdul. What his name is the name? Um, Abdul Haq. Abdul Haq. Abdul Haq. What? Bully. 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 So Mr. Yeah. Abdul Haq Bully. He made a new I Quran. Didn't bully. I, didn't Take... say bully. <laughs> I don't know. I don't understand your accent, my friend. Stop touching your nose. It's okay. You are lying. It's okay. So listen. I'm so you are saying uh, Abdul Haq bully. He is bullying the book nose. of Allah. He did Took bully. Okay, listen. Eye. So he did bully the book of Allah and he is taking words of the Quran. And now you follow the book of the bully, not the true Quran. Bully where? Well, this is a bully. He is bullying Allah. He took words from the Quran. The verse it says, "Blessed is the one is in the fire." You said to me, "There's no in the fire." So this guy, he took the whole sentence. He took the whole sentence out. Can I talk? Can I talk, please? Talk, talk. That's his surname. So don't try and say he's bullying the Quran. <laughs> well, all right. Anyway, so what do you um, mean? So what anyway. do you mean? If it's not there, he's bullying Allah. He's making fun of you, all of you Muslims. And you are buying yeah. his book. And you are buying yeah. his book. And you are taking it as a Quran now. You don't even let me speak. <laughs> you see, this is your tactics. Christian tell me friends. about, tell me about this bully who bullied Allah. This is my tactic, my friend. You cannot answer. You are lying about your book. You are saying it's not there. Okay. Can I talk? <laughs> okay, a challenge between me and you. Do you have any talk? other translation? Agree with this guy. Can I talk, please? You can talk. Please, please don't Tell do me more that. about Mr. Bully. Okay. Abdul Haq Bully. Now, let, let me talk, yeah? It won't be long. It won't be long, okay? Uh -huh. At least it won't be long. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now, this fire is there for Musa alayhi salam to get the attention so that he can go to the exact location there. Uh -huh. Okay. Wait, wait, wait. wait. Let, let me continue. That's why when he arrived uh -huh. there, mm -hmm. Allah, Allah commanded him, take off your shoes because you are in a holy place place hmm. a holy ground so the fire there was the attention yeah to show to musa al islam to come to that place but allah is not actually in the fire allah is just speaking to musa al islam from so where the fire, from where it's nothing to do with allah from where no you can talk to allah yeah yeah no, no, anywhere no. allah doesn't have to be there physically no it doesn't have you to say be there physically. no you just said that allah it's told like, him Okay. It's like I, I give an example. Yeah? No, no, don't give an example. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Isn't it the verse wait, wait, in the Quran? Isn't it the verse in the Quran says take you just said you just said Allah, you just said Allah told him to take off his shoes because this is a holy ground, correct? Yes, yes. Okay. What make it holy? Is that the existence of Allah or because this fire is a holy fire and you Muslims are Hindus or Persian who worship the fire? Well, Muslims don't worship the fire. So Where what make the ground from? holy? What make the ground holy if Allah is not there? Okay. Uh, there are places in this world that are holy. I'll give you an example, yeah? Uh -huh. Makkah. Makkah. Makkah is, is a holy, holy place. Are you sure? But let, let, let me respond then, please. Let mm. me respond. <laughs> Makkah is holy, yeah? Mm. Uh, Masjid al-Aqsa in Jerusalem is holy, mm. okay? Mm. That place, Mount, Mount Sinai, where Moses was, mm. yeah? That's a holy ground as well. There are, there are some places in this world Allah specifically chose to be holy places. Okay. The place Muhammad Sallallahu received his first revelation, yeah, Mount Hira, hmm. is a whole, it's a holy place. So why so, Allah, so uh, why Allah in the Quran, he mentioned the word holy only about Jerusalem? 
about the Holy Land. Only. No, the Quran the, uh, in Mecca, it says Mecca is holy. It says no. bless. No. Um, it, it says, yeah? No. Uh, in Sur hang on. No. It says, it says al, -bay al, -bay al Baytul Haram. <laughs> al Baytul Haram is not holy. Holy in Arabic is Muqaddas, Muqaddasa. The only time yeah, is mentioned when Allah he ordered Musa to go and kill the Palestinian, kill Hamas, and get the land. Allah he says, O oh my people, enter the holy land which Allah has assigned to you. And the word holy is only only mentioned in the Quran in two in two places, not two verses, two places, which mean either okay. Holy Spirit, either Holy Spirit, or the holy land, which is Jerusalem. That's the only place okay. Allah he mentioned the word holy. Now let's go back. Let us go can back. We can we can go, we can we can go. Everybody's laughing. Who is in the who is in the fire? No, 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 I've already explained that. Let me get to Makkah. Hmm. I've already explained. Let me let me get to Makkah. Hmm. All right. Now you said Makkah is not holy. Haram means like forbidden, which means exactly. Let me wait, wait. Let me let me let me talk, please. Yeah. Uh -huh. When he says haram, it's talking about there are some things you can do in other places, in other mosques, yeah, but you can't do it in Masjid like, um, like what? Like what? Like what? Wait, like talking, having conversations is not allowed, but in normal mosque, it's allowed. My Wait, friend, let, let me continue. My, my friend, me, my no, friend, in the, in the Masjid al-Haram, the, the dogs used to piss and your prophet don't even clean. In the Masjid al-Haram, people, the Bedouin, they used to unzip and grab their private part and they piss and the prophet don't even stop him. He says, don't stop him. What are you talking about? Not only you can talk, you can piss. I can show you the hadith about the boogers in the walls. Muslim, they take their boogers and they throw it in the Kaaba. Don't go there. So listen, listen. I really like you, and I don't know why you 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 lost your tooth, but look like you have a debate before you debated me, and today you will lose all of them. You said the verse, the verse says that nobody is in the fire. Can you prove that? Okay. You don't, he didn't even let me finish Mecca. But anyway, I don't care fine. about Mecca, my friend. Let us focus on this. We can go to Mecca later. Why, Why do you mention it then? Yeah. Because we are talking okay. about who is um, in the fire, and you are now going to tell me no, a story about Mecca no. where people used to have okay. sex around the Kaaba. I've explained to you already, no one was in the fire. Okay. okay. How, how you are going against the Quran? I want to know. The Quran says in Arabic, Buri kaman fin nar. Okay, let us I'm do not this. Going against it. Okay, let us do this. Let us do this. Going against if it. there is any interpretation, any translation beside this translation you like me to show in the screen. Any translation you like. Okay, just give me a second. Hmm. Just give me a second, yeah? I'll give you a hello, yeah. Okay. Yeah, I'm busy, mom. Okay. Okay, I just heard you talking. I thought you Sorry, that was my brother. Sorry. No problem, my friend. I have a 20 of them. <laughs> Where are you from originally? Well, my dad, he was a terrorist, actually. So when they, my mom delivered me, I got many citizenship because we were the hij hijacking an airplane. Ah, oh, come on. Don't say that about your dad. Yeah, I I'm, I'm black, that. blonde, African-American from Japan. Now give me the answer. Come on. Give me the translation no, you like me to show you. Wait, wait, wait. Let me let me have a look. Just mm, give me a second take a because look. this one takes a lot a long a long time. Mm. Okay, this is Surah twenty seven verse eight. Okay. Mm. But Christian Prince, when you talk, you have to stop being rude and interrupting people. It's, yeah, I'm an Arab, my friend. We are rude. Arab are rude. It says, but when he came to it, he was called blessed is whosoever is by the fire and who, who whosoever is around it. Who is by the fire and who is around it? Isn't this a stupid thing? Because if you are by the fire, you are on the fire. What's, what's wrong? Who is the donkey he trying? I mean, okay. how, how blessed is the one who is by the fire okay. Okay. and the one around okay. the fire? Because the one who is by the fire, he's around the fire. Okay. When he says, okay, when he says, um, okay, let's say, yeah. Um, if it says in the fire, yeah, okay, what do you understand with that? Because there's a lot, it's not in the fire. No, don't tell me, don't tell me what you understand. Is it say, does it say in the fire or it doesn't say that? Because you said to me, your, your Abdul Haq bully, he said 
there is nobody in the fire it's by the fire so now are you biting your tongue and you agree that this guy is a liar um look what's the problem with let's say it's in the fire anyway no 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 you see you were confirmed and you supposed you got me busted it doesn't say in the fire which means if it says in the fire, then we have a problem. And now you're saying what the problem. So why even from the beginning you didn't say, oh, there's in the place, so what the problem? No, no you rejected no. that because that will create a problem. So now, okay, what the problem? So now do you admit that this guy is lying? Look, I've just told you it says by the fire as well on the order. I don't care. No, the Quran says <laughs> in the fire. It's not up to you. It's not up to him. Look, can you tell me don't what tell you think. I'm asking you. I want you to confirm. Does it say in the fire or by the fire? I just told you it says by the fire. <laughs> He's a liar. If there is any anyway. other translator from the Muslim words agreeing that it says by the fire, not in the fire. Anyway, this is this is what I'm asking you. No, yeah? don't tell me what? anyway. Not tell me anyway, because all Islamic books, and I am an Arab, I speak Arabic. Here hang up. By the river of Babylon. Where you go, man? What you happen? Don't jump in the fire. Something happened, Something happened mate. Sorry about Something. that. Something. It's a genie. Yeah. It's a genie in the ball. Okay. So, can you give me another translator you accept your respect to show in the screen? Look, I've just asked you, yeah? What, even though it says, isn't it? What's the problem? Tell I'm me asking then. you, because the first question I asked you, who is in the fire? And now you're saying to me, what's the problem? Are we kids? Oh. You give me your version then of understanding. I am saying who is in the fire. This is the first question I gave you. You said Musa did not see Allah. Musa did not meet Allah. And then the Quran says that blessed is the one who is in the fire and the one who is in the fire around the fire. The one, there's one, just one, in the fire. Okay. It does say it does say around the fire. Yeah. Okay. Around blessings. Yeah. No, 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 no. I'm not talking about around. I'm talking about the one is in the fire. <laughs> okay anyway the blessing hang on don't tell the me anyway of... there's no any way in the verse don't add words okay. you know please, don't please, don't please, join please, abdul please. don't join abdul Haq, mr bully and add the word anyway there's no anyway it says blessed is the one in the fire explain what i said can i explain can i explain please so is he in the fire or not can I explain, please? You can explain, but first confirm. Does it say in the fire? Um, in my translation, it doesn't say that. No. So can I you explain, Muslim. Please? So are you, so are you a person who call me based on a translation of a guy who converted yesterday to Islam? Not yesterday. He's been a Muslim for, and the people that helped him. How, they were how many Muslim years he became a? He's a Muslim. He's been a Muslim for like well over 50, 60 years, something like that. 50, it's 60 years. Man. 50, yeah, he's an old man. He's, he's okay. like in his 80s. So, uh, I, don't, I don't even okay. know whether he's alive or not. Okay, hold on, hold on. But now we have a big problem. Your idiot, he is taking sentences from the Quran. Can I can I explain? Um, can you um? Are you going to you explain why he's an idiot? Or you explain to me why the verse is missing? Can you stop calling people idiot? I'm why not? Rude. Why not? It's an idiot, my friend. It's an idiot, the one who take for granted somebody he just he converted to Islam. You said to me fifty years, who care? But he obviously he don't speak good Arabic. He is not an Arab, and he just took a sentence from the Quran off, and he is doing alter to the Quran. He's altering the book of Allah, and now you are calling me to teach me about your religion from an altered book. The verse in the front of me, the verse in the front of me in Arabic, you can open Ibn Kathir, you can open Al-Qurtubi, you can open a, 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 any any book you want, you can open any any interpret like translation, you will see all of them they say, blessed is the one who is in the fire. You took it off totally, and now this is your execute to say, it doesn't say that, CP. Okay, um, can I respond, please? Because this is your problem. Yeah, you can, can you open your camera? We missed your teeth. Um, I can't, I can't, I can't actually get back. I don't because I don't use Skype to, a lot actually. Yeah, just so, a, just a click in the camera, like where the fire is. Plus, who is in the fire in the camera? Where? Because this is the first time actually I'm using Skype. You okay, click, so uh, click at I... the camera at the video. It says video between the the blue and the red. There is a there is a sign, an icon. You know, 
If you click in it, uh, that will show us your tooth. But by the way, I've only lost one of my teeth, you know. <laughs> I, I, I know. It looked like you, like maybe you, you met my my, my little my little cousin before you came here. <laughs> <laughs> now I was doing um because uh, um I was doing boxing and that. So one day I just got my teeth. Knocked exactly, out, you were doing boxing with my little cousin, my friend. Those my, my cousins, they are really <laughs> some something, you know. I can't see it though. Please help me out. I can't see the red thingy here. Okay, my friend. So. Can you open for me any Islamic interpretation for the verse? And you will see that you are wrong. No, no, Ibn no, Kathir, no. Al-Qurtubi, Al-Tabari, al, al All of them, they say, the one in the fire. The one in the fire. I want to respect you, yeah? I want to go back to the camera. You can see my face. I'm not scared or anything. No, no, no. I'm, I don't, I'm sure you're not scared. I mean, you are losing your, two, your teeth and you're scared. A, per, a person who loses teeth, he's never scared. But, but now you are scared from the humility because you just... Approve a book altering the Quran, and you are trying to teach the word from a book which is a false translation for the Quran. Okay, 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 okay. Let's say, yeah, yeah, it says, isn't it? Yeah, what's the problem now? <laughs> I, this is the question who is in the fire? No one is in the, it's just a blessing. When it says blessing, yeah, where, blessing where is the word the blessing? Well, the, hold on, hold on. It says a blessed is the one, not a blessing. Who cares about the blessing now? Blessed is the one it. in the fire. So there's somebody in the fire. Who's in the fire? Just give me a second. Just give me a second. Because you're like, the way you talk, man, you just, you don't let people talk. You confuse people. <laughs> yeah. This is your tactic. Are you, are you admitting I'm getting you confused now? You just admit that I'm getting you confused. Well, it says here by the fire. It's not in the fire, man. My friend, don't you know? don't force me to hang up on you. I don't have time. I, I don't want to be insulting, but you are talking like a kid now. I keep insisting that this is what it says. Open any other translation and you will see it. But you don't want to do that. You're stuck with the Abdul the bully, Abdul Haq the bully, who is bullying your God, altering your Quran, and you are taking what he say to debate me. So if you repeat the same thing again, I'm going to hang up on you. At least for today, you can call me tomorrow. If you are, what about uh, I give you? Oh, listen, what if I give you a uh, opportunity to study it and come back to me? Don't hang up, all right? I want to talk to you more because um, okay, I want then, to get... Then, then, then tell me who is in the fire. There's no one in the fire there. Okay, <laughs> okay it's not a lie. I just... I mean... I have all your Islamic translation. I speak Arabic. You can copy the verse. You can copy. No, no, don't call me. I don't have time for kids. I'm not going to waste my time. Keep repeating the same thing. You can open all Islamic translation. We have hundreds of them. Hundreds of them. Look how many. Don't call me. I have no time for kids. Open each one of them and you will see it says, this is Ahmad Ali. You can open one after one, one after one. Blessed is he who is in the fire. Don't call me, my friend. You are not worth it. I want you to study it. Take your time. Search it. And then you call me and you admit that you are following an Islamic sect altering the quran the one who made this he is a fabricator here we go so do you admit it says in the fire or not <laughs> okay look please don't 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 hang me don't hang up, uh, you know you are laughing i take this seriously i'm talking about god and you are laughing my friend you think god is a comedy for you so i'm asking you i'm asking you does it say really does it say blessed is the one who is in the fire did you investigate it before you call me i'm laughing because yeah you're behaving like a kid please don't do that it is you who is a kid you are making fun of the book of allah okay what now, okay you, when you, you when you say when you say it, it doesn't say blessed is the one in the fire that mean you are altering the book of the one you call him god and you are laughing about it i'm the one is upset and you are laughing so who is the one a true believer now you are not a true believer you are making fun of your god and you are supporting the one who lie about your quran all what i ask you for can you can you 
open any other translation to check it out if this guy is being truthful or not you refused right look i've just told you yeah mm. chris and prince i've told uh -huh. you uh -huh. why what let's say if it says in it yeah okay no 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 don't tell me let us say don't, don't tell me let us say i want you to answer me is it uh, why you don't want to go and open and read why you don't take a few a three minutes go check it out I've, and call me I've told you i've just told you allah is not the one that's in there how you so, know how you know because it's not allah how you know <laughs> <laughs> because it's not Allah. Okay, if it's not Allah, then tell me who. Blast is the one is in the fire. Musa is not in the fire, correct? Like when okay. he says. So who is the one? So who is the one in the fire? Can you tell me? Okay, if it says, "Bless the one who is in there," it doesn't actually mean it's Allah. It may be referring to a blessing that Allah has put in there. But does ah, it actually... maybe, maybe. No, it says the one. It says the one. Blast is the one, the one, the one. Do you know what the one mean? There's a person. The one. Who is the one in the fire? Mr. Maybe. I can hear you. Go, go on. Yeah. The, the religion of maybe. Who is the one in the fire? Don't tell me maybe. It's... It says it's the one. Huh? It's not Allah. That's the, that, that's what I need to tell you. Okay, who it's is the Allah. one? Who is the one in the fire? I don't know who it is, but it's not Allah. Ah, you do not know who it is. So there is a blessed one in the fire, and the God of the Quran is making a stupid statement of unknown person. <laughs> Look. Okay, where is the I, voice? Look. Where is the voice of Allah came from? Okay, thank you. Can I respond now? Uh -huh. The Allah, uh -huh. yeah, Allah can speak to you anywhere. Okay? This is another question. Allah, Where is the voice of Allah coming from? Look, Allah can be where He is. In, this is another question. Heaven. Where is the voice of Allah coming from? This is what I'm telling you. Can I? Can I? Can, can I talk, please? Explain. Okay, but don't tell me can talk from everywhere. Can Allah talk from the bathroom? Look. Can I talk to you, please? Let me explain. No, my friend, you lost all your teeth already. I'm asking you where Allah voice is coming from. Can I explain, please? I do not need explanation. Give me the answer. I, I, I'm losing my patience. No, with explanation. Where is the voice of Allah when he spoke to Musa is coming from? Is it true it's coming from a tree and that tree is on fire? The voice is there, but Allah is not actually physically The voice is there. coming there. You said the voice is there. Coming from where? We are getting closer. Here we go. <laughs> Can I explain? So you know, just tell me the voice is coming from where? Okay, okay. Uh -huh. Like right now, uh -huh. right now, me, me and you are talking, yeah? Okay. Yeah? I'm talking now? Well, no, me and you are talking right now. Wow, yeah? that's amazing. Okay. Yeah? Uh -huh. You can... Me and you can hear each other's voice, but we're not actually physically there. Don't you That's think, deep. Don't you, think, don't you think Allah can do something better than this, that what me and you are doing on the, okay. the technology-wise? Okay, hold on. So, are you saying that the Quran or Muhammad never mentioned where Allah voice coming from? Look, Allah, yeah? Hmm. Can Allah's voice can be anywhere? That's another question. Deep. Why you are why you are keeping like a you know is is your real name is Rumble? You are rumbling around. Blah 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 blah. Let us play jungle bell, okay. jungle bells, jungle all the way. Let us go, let us go around all the way. Uh, so listen, listen. I'm asking you a very simple question. Why it's so impossible for a Muslim to answer a question? Where is the voice of Allah is coming from? I've just told you, Allah is not physically there, but the voice is there. The voice is there where? Allah is oh. in his throne. Okay. Where he's at. So are throne. you saying to me that the voice of Allah is separated entity from Allah? No, it's not. Okay. So you just said to me the voice of Allah is there, but it's not everywhere. It's only in that place. Correct? Look, me and you, me and you are talking. Does that mean your voice is separated or gone somewhere? You know, separated. separated. You are is the one. You are the one who is making difference between 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 the voice and the God. So his voice is there, but he is not there, right? Look, what Allah can do, me and you cannot do it. 
Uh, can, Allah, can Allah have a son? No. You just said what can Allah can do, you cannot have do it. <laughs> no, my I'm God, saying... listen, my God, he can my God, he made Mary have a son. Can your God no. make Mary have a son? He cannot. So don't change the topic now. Listen, in the Quran, just to show you, just to show you the hypocrisy of the Abdul, and this is why you are going to lose your teeth, all of them today. In the Quran, it says in chapter 28, verse number 30. When okay. he came to it, came to what? Came to the fire. When he came to the fire, the same fire we are talking about. So when he came to the fire, he uh, uh, from the from the uh, uh, the blessed blessed spot in the valley from the tree. Okay. So where is, is where is where is the sound coming from? From the tree. Look, it says that when he reached it, a voice called out to him from the right hand side of the valley in the part which was full of blessing from out of the bush. Musa, I am Allah, the Lord of the whole world. Hmm. Throw down your staff. Hmm. When he threw it, he saw it slithering like a snake. He turned and fled and did not turn back again. Musa approached and have no Don't fear. Don't read the whole book for me. So... Where is the voice coming from? Is it coming from the tree? Hang on, hang on. When he reached a voice called out from the right hand side of the valley, in which, in the part which was full, of, yeah, the valley, yeah. No, no, no. The tree. Does it say from the tree? So your, so your guy, he skipped the tree too. There's no tree. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Wait. What? Hang on. Hang on on no, you or on the tree? Look, you, if we have a you, did, you did yeah, not read for me the word tree at all. You are a friend, the convert, Mr. Bully. Look, he took the tree off. Look, but when he reached it, a voice called out to him from the right hand side of the valley in the part which was full of blessing from out of the bush. Okay. So what's so the problem with this? The voice came from where? From the right hand side of the valley. From where? From the bush. Uh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. So why you keep saying to me the voice of Allah and Allah is everywhere? The voice I asked you a thousand times. I said, where is the voice of Allah coming from? You refuse to answer. You said to me, listen, Allah is a you know he can be everywhere. Allah voice can be. I said to you many times, where is the voice of Allah coming from? You refuse to answer. So now we come to the conclusion that the voice of Allah is coming from the tree, correct? No. I mean, the voice is, the voice is there, but... Allah the voice is there where? Where? Are you talking about Allah physically? Don't play with the game of, are you saying, are you saying, am I saying to you, oh yeah, touch your hair, touch your hair, you know, you are going to lose it too. I will make you like Sam Shamoon before you grieve. So listen, you yeah. will lose it all. Listen, 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 listen. So now... <laughs> Are you saying, I'm asking you, the voice is coming from where? Does it say the voice is coming from the tree? It does, yeah. It says from the bush. It, is that to make a difference? No, in Arabic it says actually shajara, which means not a bush. It's a tree. Okay, so what's, okay, okay. what's your So where is the here? voice coming from? <laughs> what's your problem here? Let with us this make an problem? agreement. Where is the voice coming from? Tree, do you agree? Right. Who says? Okay. Who says, so now, so now, why he have to take off his shoes? Because that tree where the voice is coming from is where is Allah is. And when I say to you, who is in the true. fire? It says, blessed the one who is in the fire. Where is the voice so coming true. from? Coming from Allah. the fire. Yeah, it's coming from the fire. So Allah was in the fire. No, he wasn't. No, he wasn't. Okay. That's not friend. true. Okay, just stay. The next time, let your dad call me. <laughs> I lost my voice repeating the same question. You can call me next time. I will go live. You know, I mean, what? what he's reading a translation of a, is an idiot. Mr. Bully. Abdul Haq Bully. Abdul Haq Bully, he now learned about Google Bully. So he decided to translate the Quran uses Google Bully, and the translation is coming Holy Bully. The Holy Quran. 
No wonder Yasser Kadhi he said the, the standard narrative has holes. Not only your teeth look like Yasser Kadhi was predicting about your teeth too. <laughs>